Hello guys and girls and welcome back to the next episode of City Skylines here in our Park Life City. Thank you very, very much for joining me. How are you today? I hope you're doing okay. Looking forward to uh, school holidays if you haven't started them yet. I know some of you have, some of you haven't. My kids are on their last week of school this week. I've got two boys, if you didn't know, and yeah, school holiday starts next week, so looking forward to that. We've got a few little things planned. I tend, I mean, I've got to still carry on working, obviously, your bills ain't going to pay themselves, but I do try and take some time off as well so we can enjoy some days out uh, and things together, so looking forward to that. So we've just been following this wasp around, there we go, look at this thing. This is really cool. This has appeared in my map here, <laughs> and I thought it, it looks really cool. It's a nice, like, addition. Um, it's acting as if it was a blimp, but, yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. So, we need to do some more expansion. We've got, last episode, we built up this lovely park here, which is doing really well. I don't think it's probably far off upgrading to the next level. Shimmel Park. We're almost there. One more visitor. There we go. Let's just speed that up. One more visitor and we'll get, there we go, we'll get that upgraded to the next level. And it didn't do the pop-up, did it? Because we had that open. But that means, um, oh, we've already reached level two with another one of these, haven't we? Yeah, so we're not getting anything extra, of course. We've unlocked, we've unlocked all the things. That's fine. Ah, oh, the sun is coming up over our city. There we go, look at that. Very, very nice. So how are things going? No, we're growing a bit, we're making money. So that is always a bonus. Let's just turn that to stop and we'll leave it sort of early morning like it is. So let's have a look. We do need some more industry, which we could probably take care of with IT. But have we still got that need down here for not enough raw services? We haven't. Oh, wow, this looks really nice, doesn't it? With the sun coming in like that, that just looks absolutely brilliant doesn't it the lights slightly on and the sun streaming in that looks cool that looks cool no i think everybody's okay now what about over here yeah well, one not enough raw materials so i don't think that's a huge issue anymore these are just complaining about not enough workers well as we grow we will get some more in so how's this doing down here let's just take a quick glance at our traffic 82 percent Ooh, not bad at all. Not bad at all. I'm pleased with that. Right, okay. So, let us... Oh, there's a fire. There's a fire going on. Let us brighten things up a little bit. Just to help you guys and girls that are on YouTube. And let's see, where can we expand? So, maybe let's add in some IT buildings. Now, we've got this land along here. But that's going to have pretty high value because it's right on the waterfront. Although, we do have this, this highway coming along here. So I am wondering whether we could squeeze in a nice little IT area along the front here. I think that could be quite nice. Why not? So these are one-way roads. But we've got this road that comes in along here. Maybe if we take... What I don't want to do is just, like, join it up from there to there to there to there. Because then we're going to end up... Hmm, we could have, like, a little U-shaped thing. Yeah, maybe we could do something like that. If we sort of went... So how close would we need to go? So we could build in the centre there. And maybe do that. So each node... Oh, that one's not... Letting me get as close. So let's go to there. Yeah, slightly different shape to that one. Yeah, I suppose it depends the distance between the things, doesn't it? Okay, we'll go with what we we'll go with what we can do. Let's get it out as far as we can before the shape goes weird, and then do that. Yeah, and then maybe get some IT in there and just sort of see how that goes. Put some trees and things in the middle. We need some water. So, I'll tell you what we could do. If we continue that a bit further, we could just grab a pipe. In fact, actually, that would just do nicely there. Let's just run this pipe along here. All the way to the end. We'll go to that road there and join that up. Slope too steep. 
Maybe we won't join it up then. I don't care. In fact, let's come all the way. So what we'll do, we'll go all the way to this one. Come on, to there, to there. Yep, there we go, that's fine. Underneath that. Excellent. And we get like three little IT areas. And hopefully, people want to move in. So if we go like that and like that. Like that and like that. They're not going to have any serve. Oh, hang on, let's pause it a sec. I've just made these just offices. Shall we make them IT or shall we keep them as offices? I think... We come along here like this. Ooh, try and keep that as tidy as possible. Let's take that bit out. Let's get that bit out. All the way along this highway. Yep, there we go. Let's make it IT because then there'll be nice tall buildings. So that's Aspen Square. Let us grab this one. IT Cluster. I tell you what, we'll do IT Cluster. But I'm going to put IT either side and this bit in the middle. I'm going to take that out. We're going to have that as just like standard sort of shops. And see how that goes. Let's rename this area. So... One of my new Patreons. Thank you very much for those that support me on Patreon. Link below if you wish to do the same. This is going to be Jazz Square. Thank you. There we go. Even $1 a month is more financial support than all of the adverts you may watch on my channel. So there we go. I'll leave that with you to consider. It's probably going to take a while before people start moving in here. Oh, here we go already. But I bet they've got absolutely no service coverage at all. No, they haven't. So, if we sort of put these here, like that, and then we'll have to do the same over here. Mm, let's squeeze that one in there. And these two this side. Yep, everybody's happy. And that, and that. It's a bit of a stretch, but hopefully that'll be enough coverage for everything. And then we just need to get some power over here. Can I squeeze that in there? Perfect. And can I squeeze... Oh, you're already touching, but just in case a house leaves. There we go. Oh, already they're moving in. Perfect. That is what we want to see. And I was just wondering, actually, about a little park in the middle. Do you know what we might do? Is we might just put through here. Let's grab that one. A road through the middle of each of these. Let's have one there. Oh, we're going to end up removing some of the houses we've been trying to get in. Uh, offices we've been trying to get in. Like that. And then, let's go to this one here. What have we got? Plaza with trees. I like these plazas. What do these do? Crystal pillars. Entertainment. Hmm. Must be placed inside a park or roadside. Yeah, okay. Well, let's not worry too much about that. Let's go for these plazas. And get that in the middle, sort of here. We can have one plaza with trees. I think that's a different size. Yeah, let's go for these two the same. Like that. So that'll give a nice bonus. And then this one here. We could go for this one. Can I change it? Yeah. So let's go for that one there. We'll have two of these. Yep, and then this one here we can go for this plaza. We just get all the plazas. So that one, and some of you are going to complain because I'm going to delete your building. Yeah, there we go. They'll come back again. Excellent. That'll be good. I think that'd be quite nice. Starts adding some height on the other side of the canal. Oh, man. Do you know, I think this is one of the best cities that I've made. This, are my, this is my Tahiti Islands one. I, I like them both for different reasons. This one because of all the open park areas. And I like that we've got gridded stuff going on in here. Which we are going to 
maybe in a few areas we're going to have non-gridded stuff as well. But I like the way it works. It, it just looks really nice with all the parks and things like that. It just looks fantastic. Good. So we're going to let that carry on building up. And I'm just wondering whether we could just put some more rocks and things around this area. And whether it could start sort of building down into into here as well. Let's just see what we can do. Yeah, people are moving in. Move in! Come and live in Tea Tree Park City. It's a fantastic place to live. Everybody here absolutely loves it. You will love it too, I am sure. Oh, that is a big rock. Let's turn that one around like that. Get that in the corner. Oh, yeah, I like that. It's like a little cave entrance in there. There we go. We need a little something over here. Mm, what have we got? We've got the cave. We've got the big flat one. No, that's too much. Let's go for something not too large. Just to sort of fill that gap a bit. Without breaking the fence. How does that look? Yeah. There we go. That looks okay. I'd like a little something here. I'm not quite sure what to put either side of that. Nothing too odd. Let's just see. Let's just put some layers in. Grab some random ones and build it up and see what we end up with. That feels like we need a little bit there. Yeah, that's not too bad. Something interesting to drive through when you come off the highway. Mm-hmm. Let's do that one there. Oh, here all the people in the fairground enjoying themselves. That's what we like. Let's spin that around and overlap it slightly. Yeah, that is not bad. That is not bad. What are we going to put here? I feel like this little section here could do with some sort of statue or something like that. We do have statues. Let's see if we can find... They're probably not called statues. They've got different names. Oh, we've got some statues. Okay. Statue of Industry, of course. Far too big. What's this one? The Rubik statue. <laughs> Quite like that one. Uh, the Rider statue. Yeah, it's too small as well. Oh, actually. Hmm. We could have that in the middle. Because these plazas and things, they're all going to be too big. Yeah. Colossus, far too big. Or maybe this one, then. If we sort of line this up, like there, like that. I mean, that's fantastic, isn't it? You're coming in that road there. Let's, let's come down here. I mean, just look at that skyline, and then it opens up. Yes, I like that a lot. That looks cool in there. It's not much, but I'll tell you what we could do. We could... We could easily pretty that up a bit. Let us grab... We've got lots of white flowers in there. Let's go for... Mm, blur. Let's go for blur. Blue. Hmm. And put one there. <laughs> That's all we need. I want this one. There we go. Let's go up to there. We'll come down to... Yeah, just, oh, look at that. We can just squeeze it in. Yep, let's do that. And let's find a large... What have we got? Let's go back to this one. Yeah, get some nice sort of trees and bushes. We could have... Oh, yeah, that would be nice. Yeah, there we go. Add a little bit of height. I'll do another one there and then... What else have we got? Something with some colour. No, too bright, too pink, too purple, too pink. Yeah, should we stick with the green ones? That is not bad, is it? Then we just need something here, some sort of small bushy... Oh, there we go, like that. Perfect. And then with maybe... Just some small little bushes around it. There we go. That utilises that space perfectly. These things here, I feel like they need to just be a little bit closer. So I'm going to do this. Now, there's one there. Let's bring that closer to the road. 
How's that look? Yeah, that looks better, doesn't it? Let's move that one in a bit as well, and that one in a bit as well. And can we find... Oh, actually, yeah, that's fine. That looks okay. Good, good, good. So what can we do? Are people moving in? Yeah. Oh, there we go. Yeah, we've got more IT over here. So is that taking care of our needs? It has. And because it's taking care of our needs, we're growing again. Excellent. Okay, I think what I'd like in here is, if we go to unique buildings, I like these Robotics Institute and Research Center style buildings. Semiconductor plant, they all look quite good. That's a bit big, the Space Shuttle launch. And I think that will fit in well with these sort of offices. I'm assuming, not assuming, I'm sort of imagining this is like some sort of high-tech, really expensive you know, IT industry place where you'd come to work and if there's research and stuff going on, that would fit in really well with the idea here. So I think if we take this one here, yeah, these go sideways. If we can fit, can I fit two on here? That's as close as that one will get. Building already exists. Oh, it only lets me build one of each. Oh, okay. And this one goes the other way. Oh, well, I'll tell you what, we'll move that. We'll have that... Sort of more in the middle. Yeah, like that. That's fine. Uh, this one here, we're going to need a road going the other way for this to exist on. So let's grab... What road are we using here? Just a standard road. Let's do that. And then grab that one. Oh, yeah, it's not going to fit, is it? That's too big. Oh, it goes that direction. I didn't think it did. Oh, there we go. It will fit in there. There we go. So that is the semiconductor plant. Oh, it actually does have visitors and makes parts. Oh, okay. So we might see some more trucks coming in there. Or maybe we'll repurpose this instead of a... Uh, what else have we got? There's other one. This one here. Software Development Studio. Do you know what? I'm going to repurpose this area. Let us uh, remove these. Sorry, it's not going to be shops anymore. There we go. I think we got all of those. There we go. It's going to be like a software house sort of place. So we're going to have to remove that park. Yep. And that will fit in there nicely. Let's have that. Let's have that there. Yep. And then we can sort of move it, mod that into the center a bit. Yep. That will do. In fact, yeah, it's going to have to connect the road, isn't it? There we go. That'll be good. And then, I think there's one more from this set. This one here, the research centre. That is quite big. That's not the same as that. We might move that one over here in the end. So, will that go... Ah, oh, this is the one I was thinking of. It goes against a sideways row, but that one's too close. So, if we put this road up here... Yeah, let's not have it connect. Let's go up to there. And then put that against this section. Yeah, that's good. We'll put it on the end. Fit a bit of parking in. And then we're going to get rid of that, get rid of that. We're going to, whoops, move this one over to here. Oh, just fits in. There we go. We've got sort of like a research complex sort of thing going on here. Yeah, that's much better. That's much better. And then what can we do? Let's have a look. Let's put some parking in here. Parking and trees. That's always the way to go. Now, I've been reading through the comments. I recorded the first part of this video like three days ago, four days ago or something, before we got Two Point Hospital and all of that. Um, here we go. This is what I want. Two by fives. So I've had a chance to read all of your comments. Uh, if we go like that. Yeah, perfect. And we go like... That. Excellent. Let's maybe stick with the 2x5s. Will they fit in there? 2x4. Yeah. Let's have parking all the way along the front here. So I've been reading through your comments on ideas on how to fix the Eiffel Tower not having the road connection, but needing road connection and all that sort of thing. Yeah, that's not going to fit them all in exactly as I want, is it? Let's move that one to there. And we'll sort of have a little gap in the middle. Yeah, that's good. Um, two by two. Let's fit some parking down the side. No. Well, let's move this over then, and then we can fit some two by twos in. That should be okay. Just, just about. So we'll have two like that. We'll have a gap. We'll have another two. Must be placed inside a part. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Wouldn't let me do it there for a second. 
Uh, yeah, that's fine. And then what I'm going to do... Yeah, so how to how to fix that. We'll get to that in a minute. Sorry, I'm talking about one thing, doing something else. Uh, and also, some of you mentioned about this railway line's a bit balked. Yeah, we'll fix that. Don't worry. Uh, I could probably fit some 2 by 2s in down here as well, could I? Yes, I could. Maybe... At the edge of the building. We'll go like that. Leave a gap. Just sort of put another one there. Yeah, there we go. We've got some parking. And then all we need to do is treefy the area. New word, new word. Let's go with some nice alders. Yeah. Let's go brush size, brush strength. And just see what we get. If we just sort of do this. Oh, that's okay. Uh, yeah, prop and tree anarchy's off. Ooh, should have checked that before. As usual, I didn't. Probably not going to get any down there. Do that myself. There we go. What have we got over here? I'm going to fill this bit as well. Excellent. And we probably could get some down the middle here if it would let me. Just a few. I feel like I want to just fill these spots with trees by the coast here. Make it... Make it still feel like it's a nice coastal, not coastal, water edge area, a bit posher, you know what I mean. There we go. That should probably do. Let's have a look. Yeah, there we go. That is not a bad place. You'd like to come and work here, wouldn't you? There we go. People already coming to work there. Fantastic. Good. Right, that's that. So, let us take a look at this. Now, there's a few different suggestions. The problem is, is you've got to connect this to a road. So, it can have garbage collection. It can have, you know, all the other things that go along with that. Uh, you know, it needs police connection and stuff. But as soon as you connect a road to the outside, people start being able to come into the park without paying. Which, I believe some are. Yeah, look. <laughs> I saw the comments about this as well. That this is connecting, which is rather annoying. And to stop that would mean we're probably... Oh, it's going to have to, like, move this whole thing. Um, but that's, that's a bit annoying that it does that when you go to a bridge. So what I'm going to try and do is... How far away will that have to go? If I go the other side of the flowers with that... Yeah... So that doesn't connect there, and then we can connect this up here. I think that'll be okay. Uh, what we could do, if I grab those, zip. Yeah, move those down there. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, which is the path we're using? This one? Uh, what's that? Space already occupied. That'll be a power thing, I'm sure. Move it over there. Yeah, that's fine. And then if we connect this one to here, that should be okay. Let's check the rest of the paths. That's a corner. That's fine. Make sure they can't get... Oh, look. They can get in there as well. It's when it changes to a bridge. The sneaky so-and-sos. Well, how am I going to stop that? Oh, that's so flipping annoying. Because if I move it, mod that out... Yeah, it's just going to go weird. If I go like that and then page up. Oh, actually, that is ever so slightly out. Actually, we can do Control H and make it the same size as that. Whoops. <laughs> Control H, same size as that. But out ever so slightly in a little bow. We'll have to just live with that. Don't have bridges. Bridge paths right next to your... Your normal paths. So I think... Oh, and this one as well. Look. All right, we'll do that. We'll do one blob in and then control H the same size as that. Oh, no. Two blobs in. Control H the same size as that. Seriously now? Three blobs in. What? Why is this one? <laughs> Why is this one being obstinate? Four blobs in. Four blobs in. Yeah, we'll, we'll have to just deal with that. Uh, that's okay, that's okay. Alright, I think we've we've solved that. And then all I need to do now is move these. Can I get any more without grabbing roads? Will that be okay? Looks like it's going to be okay. Yeah, there we go. We'll move these down. There we go. 
And we'll do that. We'll copy that. There we go. And is there any trees that are looking a bit weird? Mm, we'll copy that one. And we'll just sort of fill up this space here. There we go. Yeah, that's fine. That solves that. Right, okay. So the road thing that we're talking about. Let's turn off that. Couple of suggestions. Some people were saying try and get a piece of highway road in or highway ramp. There's two-way national road, nice and small. Uh, because they can't walk on that. There's no there's no sort of path by the side like you would have on a normal piece of road. And have that as maybe a bit of a connection. So we could do that, or to use a piece of road and then use traffic president to ban people walking on it so either one of those would work so if we can get a little road from this to connect outside somehow that would be fantastic as to how that's actually going to happen i have absolutely no clue because let's just pause it's going to have to be this one here this is the smallest one because look at the space we don't have i mean if i do control anarchy and say go down there like that that will give a connection it'll be a bit freaky weaky freaky deaky weird we might have to move that i tell you what we're going to move this let's move the souvenir <clears throat> to somewhere else yeah let's put that there yep that's fine we'll do that uh this here if we move that up to a point where it looks realistic, but it isn't messing with stuff. That'll do, won't it? And then if we can connect to this... I don't know where I'm going with this road. I mean, where the heck am I going to come up? Even if we just connected, like, over here somewhere. Uh, let's curve it around. But they've got to get on and they've got to get off. So could I connect... Tell you what, let's go like this. Curve it like that. Then page up. So there, let's turn off anarchy. Yeah, that's fine. So they can get in there now. So if we could connect this to there. Right, they can get in. And if they get out, they can go around there. That would actually work, wouldn't it? And then if we have a look at this. So uh, what we're we looking at here. Vehicle restrictions. So we don't want, I think that's normal cars, we don't want, I mean buses actually, if buses came in there, the bus could go around and drop people off, so actually that is not too bad. Taxis is fine, deliveries, I don't know whether we'd need those or not, but we'll leave them on. Uh, recycling and SOS, so anything else we're going to need. So actually, if we just do that there, that should then work. And that's not too bad, is it? That, that's actually okay. So, I mean, we could have done that with any piece of road, but I've gone for the national road, whatever. Doesn't really matter, does it? So now, hopefully, he's going to get his needs taken care of. I mean, I could have just turned him off, but then that would lose the point of having this thing here, wouldn't it? So, good. Thank you for your suggestions on that. And then the last thing to fix is some people have been saying that the rail line has been looking a bit janky, which we used the parallel road mod to build this section, didn't we? And I think when it does its connections, it doesn't always do them correctly. Yeah, like that there, look. Eagle eye viewers, well done. You've saved me lots of... Uh, I'm looking for train. You've saved me lots of problems later. What the heck? Don't do things like that. Uh, uh, which one am I going to use here? That. Is that going to make the land go weird? No, that's fine. There we go. Let's have a look. Any other... Along here. Yeah, there's another one. Come here. Let's attach that together. Yep, yeah, perfect. City's growing nicely as well. 95,000. A tiny death wave dropped below 100,000, but that's the way it goes. There we go. There's another one. Yeah, a bit annoying that the parallel road mod does that, but that's what happens. And that connects up to here, and that's fine. Did we do any other parallel road mod with that in the middle i don't think we did did we this is all work we've got a spare line here as well so we will get to use that at some point what i was thinking 
mm, is having that come up here with a passenger. In fact, because we've got the passenger one here with the monorail, so maybe not. That could come over to here somewhere. Although we've got... Yeah, that's not too far. We'll see anyway, we'll see. What are you complaining about? Flooding. Oh, the water's settling. Okay. I mean, we could have a train station in here, but it's getting the line off of this to join up somehow. I don't know how we're going to do that. Maybe at the end, have it loop round and come up here. Perhaps, perhaps. But anyway, there we go. I like this area. This little, this little frontage here looks quite good, doesn't it? And hopefully we've solved this problem as well. So, hit the big B with the tea stain to be back here tomorrow for the next episode of City Skyline. Thank you very much for watching. Any other comments and suggestions as well? Any questions? Leave them below. Always happy to help. And I will see you then. Take care. Bye-bye.